everybody, it's Norm from Test. I'm here at Maker Faire 2018 at the Google booth. This is Billy Rutledge, who's the director of AIY at Google. Uh, what is the AIY project? Yeah, AIY stands for Do-It-Yourself Artificial Intelligence, so it's AI combined with DIY for AIY projects. And you guys have two kits here, a voice kit and a vision kit. Uh, they're in these nice cardboard boxes, they look easy to make, but what's the electronics inside and what's Google providing uh, in terms of the AI? Yeah, sure. So we have two kits that we're showcasing today in our AIY product line. Uh, the first one is Voice Kit, which is on that side, uh, but here is Vision Kit. And both kits are really a, a kit of parts uh, where we include uh, the Raspberry Pi Zero W along with uh, an accessory board that we've designed that showcases a particular type of artificial intelligence. The Voice Kit showcases um, voice recognition and natural language processing, and it's a cloud-based AI. And the Vision Kit showcases image recognition, and it's an on-device AI with a neural network accelerator chip included. The on-device is super exciting to me, so you don't need to connect to the internet. The Raspberry Pi and the camera input is your an image, right? Is it a photo or is it video? Yeah, that's right. It's, a, it's the video stream coming in uh, through the Raspberry Pi camera, and we run an inference engine on the neural network accelerator chip where uh, depending on which model that you have installed, you'll be able to detect different types of images. So for example, a person, cat, dog, or a thousand common objects that you might have around your household. So that's something that at Google, you guys have already coded in with, your, with, with neural networks. It can recognize those objects you said, and not only those objects, but also faces and emotions? Yeah, that's right. So one of the, uh, one of the models that you can run uh, out of the box is uh, one that recognizes the human face. And so when it sees a face, it also measures the level of happiness, and we call it the joy score detector. Uh, we've got a demo around the corner I can show you before, uh, before you head out. But yeah, that's included, and based on uh, recognizing a face or um, some level of happiness of the face, you can take action on that within, in, inside of your uh, maker project or your build. So what, what type of output, what can you tap into when you build this? Like a score, you said, a joy score. Like, can you set thresholds for how happy it thinks this the subject is, whether a cat has walked by the frame. Yeah. and That's right, that's the general idea. We're trying to get makers excited about putting this type of AI inside of their experiments. And I don't know if you can see the back of this, but we expose a series of pens where you can connect other devices, lights, sensors, switches, motors, things like that. So when you detect uh, a certain type of image or object, uh, you can take action on it from uh, from what was in the code base. Is there any type of feedback system in terms of improving the recognition, or is that something software that you guys can potentially release in the future? Yeah, so the, uh, today we include an Android companion application that lets you configure and set up the kit, and we're adding a few features next where you can see the live uh, uh, video view coming from the camera, as well as the bounding box and output label, so you can see, yes, there's a cat and it's moving there, mm -hmm. and then you'll be able to uh, work with that uh, from your code base as well. I also love that it's a cardboard shell. It's like you said, it's a it's a blank slate. It's a canvas for anyone to to modify, to decorate. You all have examples of different combinations of these already here. Yeah, that's right. We went with a very low cost cardboard shell because our intention is to show you a basic scaffolding to hold these pieces together to understand how they work, rather than be a, a you know a consumer product device that you just use every day. So it is a, a maker product, and it's designed to let people have a, a starting point. And what we hope is that people will build the, the cardboard kit, learn from it, be excited about it, then tear it apart and put it inside of their own uh, creative project from there. Awesome. It's a pleasure to meet you, Billy. Yeah, and thank you so much. Nice. Thank you very much.